Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Acer Nitro V15, ANV15, 41. To open this device, you have to undo 11 Phillips head screws. Pop the zones behind the hinges with a lever tool. Then, pry the sides and the front. The rear side should be last. The battery isn't secured to the chassis with screws because there is a dedicated socket for it on the inside of the bottom panel that keeps the unit in place. Our laptop has a 57 watt hour battery. If you want to remove it, detach the connector from the motherboard and you can lift the unit away from the base. The capacity is enough for around nine hours of video playback. To achieve that, you have to apply the best power efficiency preset in the Windows power and battery menu and select the balanced mode in the Acer NitroSense app. According to Acer, the two SODIMs fit up to 32 gigabytes of DDR5, 4800 megahertz RAM in dual channel mode. However, since the CPU can support up to 64 gigabytes, this laptop likely wouldn't have issues running a larger amount of memory than the official manufacturer's specified limit. The RAM stick is covered with foil that has a thermal pad on the inside. For storage expansion, you get two M.2 slots, one for Gen 4 and one for Gen 3 SSDs. The Wi-Fi card is placed below the right fan. The cooling seems good for a budget device. It has a pair of fans, three heat pipes, one very long top-mounted heat sink, a smaller one on the left, and two heat spreaders.